we're here for one purpose and that's to make our voice heard. Uh, this municipal authority is planning to partner with Epiphany Allegheny to construct a fracking wastewater treatment plant. Fracking is a very volatile and dangerous industry that uses um, a whole lot of chemicals to um, inject into the ground and when they bring that wastewater act back up, that produced water they call it, uh, it's picked up a lot of radiation. The Marcellus Shale, which is underneath New York, Pennsylvania and parts of Ohio and West Virginia, uh, is super high in concentrations of radium so when this stuff is coming back up it is radioactive and that's what we're here concerned about. Pennsylvania okay fracking that's fine if you can keep the fracking material in Pennsylvania. We don't live in New York State. We live along the Ohio, the Allegheny Territory and the people that are here before you tonight are just here to tell you we don't want to see this pollution occur. I come from a family of hunters and fishermen. We have a fish and wildlife department within our Seneca Nation that just created a new walleye fish hatchery that is totally off the grid. We're here to protect our waters. My husband supplies fish to our elders and many community members. And as a mother and a grandmother and a fierce protector of our river and our lands, I ask you to really consider this project and to stop it. Yeah. Uh, we're here to defend the Ohio. It's where everything uh, gets its life from. Supported the people for uh, hundreds and hundreds of years. I don't know, I love fishing. We always use the land. It's right in our backyard, so it's got to be taken care of. Uh, it shouldn't even be a question at this point with the amount of renewable energies that are available to continue to pander to the fear and interests of the fossil oil industries. It's time that we stand up and we protect what we have right now it's for the future generation. <laughs> The fact that the Seneca Nation is coming out supporting us in this is an honor. Oh. Seneca Nation. I'm a member of Wolf Clan. Uh, the damage that just potential fracking can do is forever. We got to stop it. I don't think there's a choice. We have to somehow stop this from happening. Why should they be able to poison people and kill people and get away with it? You know, I'm, I'm hopeful they'll make a right decision, but this is a textbook case of what happens in, in cases of sacrifice areas, um, where it's small towns like this that have this unilateral ability to make a decision, and they make a poor decision, and it affects a lot of people. I think the turnout tells you that more people are against it a lot more than are for it. I think we had a good first meeting. We got many, many more to go. I hope everybody keeps up the enthusiasm. I invite everybody else to join us. Now what? What's right is right and what's wrong is wrong. Thank you. Thank you.